Hey everyone! I know it's been a long time since I recorded a video for this channel, but if you check out my vlog channel, Lady Cookie Luck, there's a little explanation on there, but I guess I'll just tell it to you real quick. I've been sick, so that's why I've been slacking, but I'm going to get back on the ball of making videos soon. Just bear with me. Um, how about them boots? Um, yeah. So... Um, I want to do a tutorial with these, but I really haven't had a chance to, but I really want to talk about them. So I'm going to record this video, but know that there will be another video coming up soon where I'm doing a tutorial using these awesome eyeshadows. Ah! Okay, so anyways, I recorded a video actually the other day, but wasn't able to find the recording so I'm just doing a new recording um, these are mineral based eyeshadows and they are from Giselle Cosmetics see this little cute thing right there Giselle Cosmetics this is a stack of eight let me make sure of that one two three four five six seven eight and these are uh, $14.97. They have 12 different stacks to choose from. And I'll post the link down below so you can go check out their website. They have all kinds of different um, makeups, blushes, powders, bronzers, foundations. And um, I got three stacks right here. And this one is Renaissance. Renaissance. There's eight of them. Durr. Um, just like blues and plums and golds and some darker colors up here. This looks like a black and like a gray. And then this one is called Starry Night, which I love the name of. And yes, I'm missing some nails. They just happened to got got plucked off the other day. Anyways, this is Starry Night. And it's got like cream colors and a white and grays and blacks. Like it's the perfect stack for people who love smoky eye and that's what it looks like um, I wonder if you could take that off I'm actually and it's not a, a product flaw it's just the way that uh, containers are made and there's a good reason for it so all the product doesn't fall out but I can't stand that I personally don't like it because it's sometimes hard to get out my face bronzer from Bare Minerals is the same way. Makes me mad because i got to empty it all out in the lid. But anyway, the cool thing about these stacks is that you can mix and match. If, say, you want to take this top one, and it's a dark gray, and you're going somewhere for the day and you want to bring your eyeshadows in case you need to touch up, you can mix and match. So, like, I can take the white one with the dark gray, or however you want to go about all you do is twist them off twist them back on and you can bring them wherever you want to however you want to and Tippy's being bad she's growling in the background anyway so this one is called California Gold and it's just like creams and this is a dark golden looking color and then like beautiful teal blues up here um, in my other video, I did a really good swatch, too, and I showed you, like, my favoritest colors. And I'm going to do that again, but the other camera actually had better quality, but what else? I'm going to do what I can now. I'm going to put a little primer down. Primer is really good for folks who uh, their eyeshadow seems to crease a lot and or wear off throughout the day. Primers um, keep your eyeshadow on longer. And in a lot of eyeshadows, Tippy, come here, come hither, child. It actually makes a lot of eyeshadows look super like vibrant. It just brings out the pigment in the eyeshadows. It's stuck to my finger. Anyway, come here. See, this is another reason why I have a hard time video, and I'm harassed by dogs all day long. Okay, anyway, let's see. I'm gonna show you this one. I gotta take these little things off. This one is, oh, another thing I want to say, like you can empty them in the top up here and then pick it up with your brush or sponge, whatever you're going to use, your sponge tip applicator. 
that color is gorgeous and what was that blue I love this blue this blue is amazing they're so pretty they show up so pretty and just the pigments in them are just awesome uh, let me get this other one this one right here this is another one I'm in love with this is at the top of the California gold stack it's like a beautiful teal blue and then what am I gonna pick up maybe I'll pick up the black just to show you the black all the colors show up really well now this black these other ones are pretty you see how like shiny they are this black I don't think it's very shiny which there's nothing wrong with that I'm just saying it's it's not as shiny as the other ones maybe because it's black I don't know but it's real um just dry looking not dry but what's the other word like they have different words for the different textures of eyeshadows it's like matte looking no that's like lipstick if you could find the word you could more than welcome leave it down below and then I'll be like ah thanks yeah so anyway um I don't know if I have any room to swatch anymore since I only put the, the primer on a certain part. I guess I really don't need a primer. Primer's not necessary. Seriously, it's not. <clears throat> I don't use primer for everything. This one is so, like, mermaidish. See, that is where... No primer. And it's like a... The light teal blue. Those are my fingers. <laughs> Hi, guys! Um, anyway, they're just really cute, and I really like the fact that you can switch them up if you want to, because I'm the type, oh, let's see, I was going to show you my purse, I bring my makeup purse everywhere with me, and I always have to bring an eyeshadow in case I need to touch up on any spots of my eye, like eyeliner or eyeshadow, whatever, so I think it's really cool that they're actually, um, uh, removable, and you can mix and match them and take them wherever you go, whichever ones you're going to use for the day, and you can do two, three, four, or you could take the entire stack of eight. Um, <coughs> sorry. I had a bad cold. I had a flu, and then I had a cold, and then I got stuck with this cough, and it's never went away. So anyway, um, the eyeshadows, they're easy to apply, just like most eyeshadows. They stay on pretty good. They show up pretty good. They come off easily, which I actually like because I'm the type that has to scrub my makeup off, so these come off really easy. Not saying that they won't stay throughout the day, I'm just saying by the end of the day when you're ready to take it off, it's not a struggle, which I usually have. And I just spilled some eyeshadow on my computer. So yeah, anyway. There they are, and they are $14.97 for a stack of eight. And... Like I said, they have 12 different stacks to choose from. You can check them out in the website, check out all their stuff. And I'll be doing a tutorial soon. Sorry, I haven't been recording anything lately. I've been sick. See, that's so cute. Giselle. Giselle Cosmetics. Forgive me for my being so... Not recording. I don't even know why I wore this hat. Forgive me for not recording anything lately. <laughs> I'm kind of digging the hat now. Tippy's being so bad. She's being a dog. I've been meaning to record this video because I really like these eyeshadows and I wanted to introduce them to y'all. But um, I got a sunburn today, by the way. Not sure if you can tell. Probably can't tell. Wait, which arm was it that you could really tell a little while ago? It's like red right here and then white. Tippy, come here. Come here, we need to have a talk. We need to have a talk. Now talk to the computer. Tell all my subscribers that you're very sorry for whining during this video. There was no reason to cry. She's very sorry. And she loves Giselle Cosmetics. And <laughs> she's like, let me go. She's such a good girl, but she just hates being held down and locked in a bedroom with her mom. Whatevs. Anyway, so thanks for watching. Um, 
subscribe if you haven't yet. Forgive me for being so distant lately and not recording. I've been sick. And she's such a brat. My dogs are brats. Brats. Okay, anyway, thanks for watching. I'm out of here. Peace. And yeah. My hands are so dry. They're like an old lady. Yeah, the colors are really awesome. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll be posting more soon. Like I said, I'm going to do a, um, Timmy. I'm going to do a tutorial soon. Oh, another thing I wanted to mention is that I'm not sure if a lot of you know this. Most people do. The awesome thing about pigment eyeshadows, you can add them to clear fingernail polish and make your own colors. You could use any one of those colors to make your own color. Um, you could add them to lip glosses. I don't know if you'd want to wear those as lip gloss, but you can pretty much add them to anything. You could make get them wet. I'm sure they work well with wet or use them dry. So yeah, I just wanted to remind you of that in case you didn't know it. Okay, I'm out. I got to take care of this Dizog because she's being a... Where is that? Oh, oh yeah. Was I talking about being sunburned a little while ago? I'm sunburned everywhere. My entire stomach is sunburned, and my thighs, and my knee. I'm like a lobster. Okay, I'm out. Bye. Say bye, Tibby. Bye. Goodbye, everybody. Bye.